today I'm in the city of Ibadan and I'm currently at one of the highest hills in Ibadan, the Okiare Hill and I'm here just behind me here is the Boas Tower. It's um, an historic monumental piece that is amazing, you know, it's um, also known as Mayuko, you know, like something that turns and there's this saying in Yoruba that says that Ibadan Lomo or Molaizu, like you know Ibadan, you don't know Laiku. And that's the very honest truth because I've lived in this city for close to like four years and I really did not know about Boashua for a very, very, very long time until like my second or third year of living in this city. Hi people, I'm currently in the city of Ibadan. Like this is tagged as the Brown Roof City, like because when you climb this tower just behind me, you can literally see almost everywhere in Ibada, like literally almost everywhere. We're gonna climb together, we're gonna explore this place together. So yeah, don't worry, just keep watching this video. Uh, my name is Olua Atife, I'm the staff of Maximum Travels and Tours. And Maximum Travels and Tours is a travel consultant uh, agency and uh, a tourism agency. We've been in existence for a few years and we can help you arrange tourism package within Africa and outside Africa. So currently right now, I'm on a local tour in the city of Ibadan and I'm currently at Boas Tour. And this is the tower behind me right now and uh, let's explore the tower together. tower. In honor of Aperu's Ed Boa, first resident and traveling commissioner of the Kiro New Bad Land. 1887. So Boas Tower, after So 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 the <laughs> Oluwanu ebe o sa lo for years odun meni lolo olorun fun se o se to ogun e o wa pada si lo e so after gba to lo tan gba to ada 1936 won wa ko to wa ni iran ti e ke so gangan gan loko be ton lo dictate ibi pe bi lo ani center ibadan to gaji pe te ba do si be free wi a ko gbe ba ni be te ni re lo dictate e so gba to pare for years e to se to ogun e to lo tan won wa ko ni 1936 ja pe gba na o so Oni pa di ara won. E ma ma wo ra lo to be ton oni pa di. 
e bi be se le fe ko yan wa se lai e ma po ta ma to bi 50 nkan won le lo le kan na won le ma lo ni bi tete to tete ma ti lo ta ma fe ma so kale anu da ti a ma lo e da pa de la bet wa ma wo na bet won ni pa de ara won to te ba gba bi lo oke o da se de le ma gba so kale to e ni pa de ara yin so e kan ta fi pe ni laye po gan step yen na fi pe ni laye po spara step ni e ma gbo ke e ma ran di e ma ran di e ma te fi ma doke so na fi ma pe ni pe ibadan lemo e mo laye po so believe awon eyan ni pe te ma wa ibadan bi lati bi 20 years te ba ide bi e te mo ibadan so awon eyan ma ro ko boya e ibadan lemo lai pe boya be kon ni gbe ki se ko we ki se jibiti so step ye last step ye won na fi pe ni laye po e ko awon eyan ma tun mo pe boya e boya gbo jibiti ogbo keni karara ko ni be step ye na fi pe ni laye po so bi ta ko e gan to ti jade won ni gba fe commission ta ko tan gba ye awon ba le gba ye e ko awon e mo gbo yibo won o se ngba ta wa gbo kele pa o la ye po o la ye po o la ye po la ye po bi te laye po ti jade ni to ati gba na te wa pe ni ri laye po gba da lemo e mo laye po so ele lo wa wa lati 1936 ye lo ti da wa nu gbo gbo awon ile won o si won be ngba ye oni kan lo da wa to gba ta wa da 1996 so ke 99 gbo awon ile won na se wa ko gbo e gbo awon ile bi ta wa e so um that's all about the history of boas tower and i'm going to be going up right now i would climb the spiral stairs I, a lot of people have claimed that the spiral stairs actually make them dizzy kind of so yeah i want to try it out and uh, i'm going to let you guys know what it is if you want to experience it by yourself all you have to do is very simple just contact us at maximum travels and tours and we'll be so glad to take you around you know the historic places in nigeria i'm currently in the city of ibado and yes i'm not only just going to stop here there are other um you know tourist attraction centers that i'm also going to be visiting and i'm also going to post them on our official youtube platform so in case you don't want to miss out on any of those videos make sure that you subscribe to the youtube channel make sure that you turn on the post notification so whenever we drop an update you get to be notified like asap that's right so yeah let's go up and enjoy the experience with me for quite a while so yeah the stuff's actually fading and i'm just gonna go around uh this is the step it's actually not bad honestly okay so some people went in through the first entrance I was facing. I'm just going to go through the other side because you know the man said something about if you pass through the second entrance you won't meet like you guys don't meet each other you're going to see each other. So yeah, I'm going to try it out and see. Okay, so there's something else here again. It says Genesis of Boas Tower Tourist Center. The monument was the through the noble effort of the Minister of Commerce and Tourism under the following honorable ministers and um, names and death from 1996, 1997, 1998, and 1999. Okay, so yeah, it's about time for me to go up. And, uh, so, this is what the entrance looks like. This is what the entrance looks like. You know my honest opinion? It's kind of cool. But yeah, let's go. I'm trying to. I honestly think it was a bad idea for me to actually wear a very big skirt climbing these stairs. I think it's like one of the baddest that I have ever made. Most propitious decision <laughs> that I can actually make. Like it's really dark in here. Okay, so just like I said earlier, this is one of the places I'm going to visit in Ibadan. There are several other places that I intend to also visit. And I'm, doc I'm going to document the journey so you guys would experience it from my perspective. And you can experience it by yourself if you're interested as well. You get what I mean? So, um, I'm also, I think I read it somewhere that the person, the engineer who designed 
Igowa Stoa was also the one. I can't really place his name right now, but I'm going to place it on the screen somewhere. Uh, the engineer who designed Goa Tower was also the one that designed Mapo All. I'm going to be going there after this, but I'm going to post a separate video for that. So you want to um, check that out. I'm going to link it somewhere up here. So you get to watch it. Yep, yep, yep. So uh, basically, I think that's it. Uh, it feels so refreshing to be up here. Like the hair really smells great. <laughs> I'm just lying. I don't know, but like it feels really good to be up here. Like it gives you this, oh, I'm a bird kind of feeling. And you remember the time when I was at Olumorok? I, I mentioned um, that you can literally see almost not all of Abel Kuta, but like a really large part of Abel Kuta. And I said, oh, Abel Kuta should also be tagged as the Grand Road City, but yo, this view cannot actually beat Abel Kuta's. It can, it's like, hands down, it's gonna beat Abel Kuta's view. Like, it's gonna beat it down like 10 over 10. You can literally see almost everywhere in Ibadan. I also read that this Okiare Hill is the highest point in Ibadan. Yeah, the highest point because you can almost see, like, almost everywhere. Like, you can, you can see, but. <laughs> Yeah, it feels so nice to be up here. I think I'm just gonna go down right now in the next few minutes. Um, I'm gonna soak in the view for a while and I'm gonna go down and I'm gonna move on to my next destination. And yeah, that's it. If you've ever been to, you know, um, Boas Tower, you can actually let me know in the comment section. I'll be so glad to hear about it. Just let me know if you've been here before. And if you were once like me, you lived in Ibadan and you did not know about this, Tower, which is tagged as the Laiku Tower. You don't know about it? Like, let me know as well in the comment section. <laughs> and if you've been here once or twice, then yeah, that's fine. You can as well let me know. I'll be so glad to read about all of them in the comment section. And don't forget, my name is Olua Tite and I work for Maximum Travels and Tours. It's a travel and tourism agency that can help you with your visas to different countries outside Nigeria, obviously. And if you're a foreign national and you need a Nigerian visa, yo, who are your best blog, you can actually contact us as well. Uh, there are numbers that are going to be slide on the screen, so you can just pick any one of them. They're WhatsApp enabled, so you can actually communicate with one of our representatives like very fast. And um, yes, we can help you organize stories and packages. Uh, we can take you around places like this in Nigeria and we can as well take you within Africa as well. We have several East Africa tours. You can actually check our platforms as well for that. We have several of those videos and of course more and more and more is going to be coming up. But, and in case you want to see more of me as well, you can actually check me out on all my social media platforms. The name is Uniformed. It's underscore Oluwa everywhere. So yeah. I'm going to show you the view one more time and I'm going to be editing down and moving on to the next destination in Ibadan. I hope you guys will definitely love the experience from my perspective. Okay, so uh, I can I can like see a lot of places. Let me just walk around so you get to see before I start pointing out places or I guess I should just pretend to see. <laughs> Oh, okay, okay. Okay, so I said I was going to uh, mention some of the places I know. So that place I'm zooming in on currently is, I think that's UCH. Yeah. Uh, what else do I know? Okay, that place over there is the stadium. I think it's the Lake Hotelami Stadium. I really don't know exactly what it's called, but I guess that's what it's called. That one over there, you can see that point on two. So that's the stadium. I can see Coco House, that very tall and, should I say fat building? Yeah, that's um, Coco House. It's one of the tallest buildings in Ibadan. Yep. I'm also trying to see where else, where else, where else I know. I think those are the only few places I know. It's a shame of me though, because I lived in this city for quite some time. And uh, I can just point out some places, like just few places. Sorry. Okay, I can see the, uh, I think that's the Mokola Bridge. There's a bridge over there. Yeah, so that's the Mokola Bridge. I, I know like few places like that. <laughs> 
Okay, so um yeah. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching the video up to this part. If you are watching right now and you've not subscribed, boom, what are you waiting for? Click on the subscribe button and turn on post notifications so that you get to be notified immediately we drop any updates, okay? Yes. And of course, I'm going to be going back now, down. I'm just going to go back, uh, climb down the Boas Tower. In case you want to experience this yourself, you know what to do. Just contact any of the numbers sliding on the screen and we got you open. Yes, that's it. Thank you, thank you so much. Till I see you in another video, do have a beautiful and amazing day every day and stay blessed.